Bubber Ann, good evening. Here's what I would do. Jocko, the Navy SEAL style. You have to get over the psychological disgust of your roach. If I found out through medical authority that ingesting your roach, the roach won't kill you, you could eat your roach. You know what I would tell a man? And I'm telling you the truth. If medically you could eat that roach, put the roaches in a, in a paper and, and eat them live. You heard what I told you, Barbara? Eat your roach live. If I was in the Marine Corps and I was a drill instructor, Barbara, one thing I would do, believe me, to overcome a fear, you got to walk into the fear. If we know that eating roaches, you, 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 is, uh, you can do it to get over the psychological disgust, I'd have those boots-eating roaches. That's right. I'd have these boots-eating roaches, live roaches. To get over the disgust of your roach. Just like they have you walking around and say, let those sand fleas bite the hell out of you. What do you think's going to happen in Vietnam? Let those sand fleas bite the fuck out of you. Don't push your death. Like sand fleas bite hurt like hell. Especially under that poncho. You got to train them hard. You got to blood them hard. You got to knock all the civilian, all the mummy crap out of them. It's that important. You go to war, you train them for, to, for war mentality. That's all. I'd have them eat those damn fucking roaches. Eat your roach. Eat him live. So you overcome the psychological disgust of your roach. Knowing one thing, when your roach crawls over all over you, if he crawls all over the baby, Barbara, he doesn't bite. He can transmit diseases, of course. The roach is a filthy bug. Disgusting, filthy bug. He goes everywhere. That's all. He's not like your bed bug. Your bed bug will bite the shit out of that baby. God damn, that bed bug will tear that baby up. The roach won't do that. That's the difference between both insects. That's all. you got to get over the psychological disgust. That comes first. You gotta get over that, whatever it takes. And I tell the boot, the boot has to kill a living, maybe it's a chicken, maybe it's even a cat. Your boot has to kill that cat to feel what it's, what it's like to kill something living with your own hands. You gotta do it. You're going to war, man. That's the way I say it. And life is very much like that, Barbara. And that's what I found out. That's what I see. It's a pay as you go world. Each has their own, none has a time. How do my bills get paid? How do my fucking bills get paid, bottom line? Hold up your own weight, man. Put your hat back on your head. Don't hold it out. That's all. Bottom line.